Beacon, a friend of uh, mine, uh, very emotional, and there was another uh, devotee, uh, and suddenly they had decided something again between themselves, and then suddenly they both uh, turned to me and said that. come to the market today uh, we're going to help um, uh, with uh, selling and I asked uh, is, it, uh, is it like a book selling and the devotee said no it's a um, uh, vegan food uh, selling And it was like uh, they had uh, decided that it will happen as well. So, um, After uh, we had uh, finished uh, eating, mm. I followed uh, my two friends. One of them was vegan and just then one of them was devoted. And I think there was someone else also, but I don't remember. I think there was another devote also, but I don't know. Um, I was started walking to the market. And while we were walking, we were um, already sharing uh, stories. Uh, and it was... Uh, Interesting. We were walking uh, past the church, and I shared um, my experiences with uh, this church. Uh, and we discussed different things like relationships. And we reached the marketplace by walking. And it was in an old town, and it was a special Christmas market. And then another very interesting thing happened. I have never seen anything like this. Uh, they led me to this place where this, um, they had this uh, vegan selling store, among other stores. And, uh, There was a devotee uh, selling uh, and uh, very busy and uh, he was like um, almost shouting like can somebody help uh, I can't do this anymore I'm so tired also like food uh, distributing they offer free sample cups uh, for tasting and that's uh, very interesting so I said like like my wife was calling and uh, I said I'm going to uh, bring the children to town can you take them and later bring them back to me to the swimming place 
as it is uh, so so I didn't uh, I can stay uh, right away but this devotee who was uh, selling he said like uh, whoever is uh, like willing to help uh, you can come here later at 8 o'clock in the morning and uh, I remember that uh, he said um, I'm busy with children at the moment she just called that we like met there like um, I tried to help I said I don't like something uh, I'm trying to understand and trying to help and, and, yeah, and uh, I took the children uh, yeah, from from the station and then we walk with children to the swimming place uh, I put the children to the swimming place was come back to my wife and uh, I walk back to the Christmas market and this devote was uh, there uh, selling it and uh, I said like, uh, like I can uh, like we were starting to discuss that uh, tomorrow morning I could uh, start helping already uh, selling uh, the vegan uh, food uh, at Christmas market <coughs> so the because it was made uh, without phone like normally I hate in workplaces that you need to have a mobile phone you need to have a uh, quarter but this one was very nice like uh, like uh, the devotees from the temple would walk there naturally like normally without the machine yeah. and uh, we reach the market and he was like asking verbally and uh, also the deal itself that I can have there tomorrow morning that was made without the phone so it was very super nice for me because I hate the workplaces always have phones like I hate too much technology for me like I have Buddhist background I hate when the workplaces require technology in a bad way like for example in the security service you need to have a phone so that they can call you if you're late so, like it's too much technology for me um, like we should trust more maybe so yeah that's pretty much it uh, uh, and there's uh, many people there's this whole new temple network behind this uh, known temple network there's another temple network that's international or something like that so sure we can trust this high level um, devotees uh, no question about 